And if you just give me one second, I've been crying for a month. But my, 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 my tears are tears of joy um, because um, the most amazing thing just happened to me. Um, so I'm a mom of three athletic children, and I spent so many years, like we all do, trying to get rid of that nasty odor that literally surrounds us everywhere we go and on carpool night. So I got sick and tired of trying all these things that never worked, and I decided I was going to invent something myself. The interesting thing is, I didn't know anything about creating a product or marketing a product or, or manufacturing or websites or e-commerce. I mean, you name it, I was starting from scratch. I did have a successful job already, so I was just kind of adding this little fun thing in on the side. Um, what turned to fun, uh, what was started as fun, turned to work very quickly. So I did invent that product. And not only did I invent that product, but it was awesome. <laughs> um, and it, within eight months, I found myself on the Today Show having to pre present my story and sell my product. They gave me one minute, and I won the next big thing on the Today Show. <laughs> Which then in turn, the next day, they immediately took me to QVC, and I was able to sell my product live. I sold 5,000 units in eight minutes, and we sold out. I did this and I got lucky would that be as inspiring as if I told you that I was amazing and super talented <laughs> but I was lucky that's the honest truth but the harder you work the luckier you get was it easy absolutely not as a matter of fact it was the hardest year and a half of my life everything I had done prior to that was a lot easier than going completely out of my comfort zone and starting something new at 40 years old. I had my children watching every step that I made and I was not going to let them down. So no matter how many times I doubted myself, no matter how many times I couldn't sleep at night or how many tears I cried, I was not going to quit. I kept pushing. And the reason is because a mother is not about me, it's about we. It's about knowing your strengths and your limitations and being humble enough to ask questions when you need to. It's about teaching our kids that life can be hard, but guess what, we can do hard things. <laughs> so let's, um, let's, I'm just relishing in this moment as I've um, done this and I feel like I'm sitting in a room of such amazing, talented, people and we don't even know what our talents are unless we challenge ourselves and we take risks. This never would have happened if I didn't just put one foot in front of the other and ask questions and build relationships with all those people around me. Thank you. <laughs>